everybody, good morning and welcome to another exciting action-packed episode of Jeff and Steph's Excellent Adventure. Now, it's morning and who doesn't want to start the morning with a great cup of coffee? I know we do. So what we do is uh, we do a pour over coffee and what really started this whole thing with pour over coffee for us was um, we had a terrible ice storm uh, last winter and we were without power for 10 days and we had no electricity, we had gas so we could make hot water on the stove. Um, and in the past we've used Keurigs and we use the Ninja and we've used Mr. Coffee and any other different percolators, every other type of coffee maker uh, known to mankind. And I got this plastic comb for a Christmas gift from my daughter. And I said to Steph, we can still make coffee because we got the pour over coffee comb. So we figured let's give it a go. And um, honestly, this is the best tasting coffee we've ever had. And th the advantage over this is you're not gonna get the bitterness and the weird taste from basically dirty coffee makers, which yeah, you can clean them with vinegar and you can use these products to clean them and they always have a weird taste to them. This way, you always get a pure, fresh cup of coffee with no bitterness. In fact, um, it's so smooth, I used to drink my coffee with um, milk and sugar. And I think part of that is just maybe masking the taste of coffee um, because you don't really understand what coffee's supposed to taste like. But since doing this, I just drink it black. It's smooth, it's delicious. And I, I give a lot of credit to this method for the smoothness, but a lot of the credit also goes to uh, this particular coffee we use, which is Black Rifle um, Coffee Company. And it's a veteran owned company and they give, give proceeds of each bag of coffee um, to the troops. So if you, it's kind of hard to find in stores, but they have a really good coffee club. Um, you sign up, they deliver it to you, your house. Um, there's all different roasts. We like this particular one, which is the Freedom Roast. Um, really, really, really good coffee. You can get it pre-ground or you can get it whole bean, grind it yourself. We prefer to do it this way. Um, Another advantage of this is in the RV life, um, you're very conscious of your counter space and weight and all those types of thing, things. So this method works really good for us. So basically what you do is you get yourself a tea kettle with a little spout. It has to have a spout. Uh, a lot of people use the long necked ones. We went with this one. Uh, it seemed to work really good. Um, and the advantage of this is it basically isn't gonna spill all over you it's gonna go straight to where you wanna put it. So I put my two scoops of coffee in here with a filter, uh, two tablespoons, and then we just do a nice slow pour over of the coffee. And the thing I really like about this is I make the coffee every morning uh, for Steph and myself. And if you love coffee, the experience of making the coffee is, is really nice because you smell it right away and the aromas are so nice and uh, you get this really nice frothy foam that is full of flavor and honestly it's fun to do. I mean, I, I'm all for easy and I get all that but this is kind of a fun way to make coffee and it starts the day right. Um, just gets you in the mood to have a great day. And uh, I don't know if it takes more time. To me, it's, it's pretty simple and fast. Um, just wait for it to finish dripping through and you're ready to go. And, and again, the, the Black Rifle coffee is, is just so smooth. Highly recommend it. They also sell um, apparel. Uh, T-shirts, mugs, all the proceeds, a portion of it goes to help our veterans. And we love our veterans. Uh, both of our fathers were veterans. My brother was a veteran. Uh, a lot of people we've met, good friends. 
um, our veterans and where would we be without our veterans? That's why we get to live the life we live. Uh, so God bless our veterans and uh, God bless the guys that make this coffee. They're, they're really a, a real company that makes a great product. So anyway, that's just about done. So let's give it a taste and see how it works. Boom! Now that's what I'm talking about. That's so good. No sugar, no milk, just smooth, great tasting coffee. So anyway, once again, um, if you want to try something simple and easy in the RV life, this is really the way to go for us. Best tasting coffee we ever had. Um, we literally go to bed at night and look forward to making coffee in the morning. So uh, check it out. Um, talk to you guys soon and uh, God bless America, God bless our veterans and uh, we'll see you soon.